Welcome back guys to another video on the channel. You want to make some coins? I'm here with another video. Today I'm going to be showing you how I've been making coins lately. We have been flipping shadow and hunter cards. I'm going to show you exactly how to do it. Some proof so you guys know that this is actually a legit method. So make sure you hit the like button on the video. Make sure you subscribe for more FIFA trading videos, all that good stuff. We are going to be streaming very soon on YouTube. Now let's get into it. So I'm going to go into my transfer targets because I've picked up a couple of deals. We've got Wilson in a Hunter. And, well, we've got two Wilsons in a Hunter for 1800 each. Now, when I eventually sell these on, guys, there's a very good chance, because I get this question a lot. Ben, you know, Glander, when you sell these cards, the chemistry style changes to a basic. It's just a glitch, I think, on the system. When you sell these cards, when you comes to the, the sold section, it will come up that it is a basic chemistry style rather than a hunter. Now, what's so great about this method? Well, it doesn't matter if you've got 5K. It doesn't matter if you've got 50K, 20K, 100K. I'm even using it at 350K right now. I didn't actually have access to the web app because I deleted my FIFA 20 club. Bit of a fool me like. So yeah, I actually managed, I feel like I'm a week behind. Anyway, let's look at how much currently Callum Wilson's actually going for. I'm going to show you how to do this method just after I show you kind of some proof. Now, Callum Wilson, all you do, Callum Wilson in a Hunter, because uh, obviously this is Shadow and Hunter, so I am going to be looking at Shadow very, very soon. Sorry if I talk quick, you know, I need to get myself back in the groove. Now, let's just have a look how much he is going for. Now, Wilson, as you can see, 5.5k. Now, will he sell for 5.5k or 5.3k? I'm not too sure, but the beauty of this method is the fact that the return on investment, you may invest 2k into a card, and you might be able to sell it for 4.5 or 100% return on investment. Open bids. There is a, a video by Flair. If you want to, if you prefer sniping, you're very good mentally about remembering prices. I do recommend checking his video out. Flair FIFA. Check his video out. It's pretty much the same concept. Trading with um, Hunter Shadows, but sniping. Anyway, so Callum Wilson's going for about 5.3k. We are going to list him on the market for around about 4.8k. I don't want to be greedy, but however, I could maybe, you know, considering the coins I have, I could maybe stretch it to 5k. However, for the purpose of the video, I want to go show you guys some proof that this method is working. Now, we're going to go over to my trade poll because you might have just saw a glimpse there, guys. I do actually have quite a few. I'm going to show you a couple of players that I've bought in the last 10 minutes before recording this video because I wanted to have some players. Um before you know i jump into this video so we can look at to miscast the backup left back that liverpool signed from olympiacos for eight million now i paid two thousand coins for this guy i didn't actually show you but i will show you so anyway to miscast wherever you spell his name is to miscast yep there we go shadow i'll pay two thousand coins for him how much are we going to be able to sell him for so 4.2k is the cheapest when i checked earlier 4.2k there was actually three of them so it does look like that he could potentially sell on for a little bit more. So what I'm going to do is have a look at the second lowest buy now. So the second lowest buy now is 4.3. 4.2 been up for you know seven minutes. We're going to list this card up for 4.1 and hopefully it sells. So to miss gas 4.1, you love to absolutely see it. And I know guys, you know, it's probably three or four minutes into the video, but I want to show you proof that this is actually working. Now, another card I'm going to show you, Yedlin, 3.2k we've purchased him, purchased him for very very good now guys if you're still into the video when's the best time to trade in my opinion you'll probably have a lot more success after six o'clock just because there's more cards on the market during the day i'm talking i'm recording this at half one so maybe one o'clock onwards when this starts to pick up like the market starts to pick up because obviously europe etc the whole america's slowly coming on now yedlin Plays for Newcastle, very fast right back, plays in the Premier League, of course. We paid 3.2k. There's none up at 7, well, there's a couple up at 6.3k. Again, will he sell for 6,300? I'm not too sure. So I'm going to do a decent sized undercut so someone thinks it's a decent deal. And we're actually going to list this card up for 5.8k. Now, guys, look at the amount of coins I've invested into this card 3.2k, right? And we're going to hopefully sell him for 58 Okay, so list on the market, lovely doubly. Now, we have loads of other cards. I picked up a couple of frenzies at 4.8, 3.8k. He's a very good deal. Look, 3.8k. I know he roughly sells for 6.3. We picked up a towel for 5k. A, 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 a Lala, shall I say, 
uh, 8k and another Wilson. So what I'm going to do, guys, before I show you the method, I want to see somebody sell so you guys actually see them selling. Right, guys, so about 20 minutes in, a couple more have sold. I just wanted to show you quickly. This is before the next clip about Yedlin. Tremiska has sold for 4.1k. I don't know which one of the Florenzis, the one that we might have listed for 3.8, uh, the one we bought for 3.8k, sold for 6.5. There's a bit more proof. Again, just got to wait a little bit. 20 minutes into the uh, into the auction is what it is. However, enjoy the rest of the video. Okay, I've literally just stopped recording. Yedlin has already sold for 5.8k. You love to see it. Invested 3.2k, sold for 5.8k. And that is what you love to see with this method because... You know, the tax is very little. So it's literally pure, pure coins. So 3.2K, 5.8K, you love to see it, 2.6K. So around about 2.4K after tax on that one Yedlin. As you can see, to miscast 57 minutes. So you can pretty much see that Yedlin sold pretty quickly. Now, um, I'm going to actually show you how to do it, guys, now. Yet the time has come. I'm going to show you how to do it. I've got to increase that watch time, you know what I mean? Anyway, so however you do it. So it's pretty simple, pretty standard chemistry shadow or hunter right quality i just leave as it is any and then what i do i start off at three thousand coins now if you start off with three thousand coins and you get this like it's 15 minutes you don't really want to be waiting 15 minutes for one card so what i start doing is in increasing it by 100 each time until you're sort of coming up with a few cards under a minute or two left or you've only got a couple minutes so as you can see nothing really is popping up like unless you want to wait 10 minutes. So what I'm going to do is just increase it until we get to that point. So 4K, so 24 seconds. Now, this is where you go through all the open bids. So Matip has got an open bid. I'm probably not going to win that card because it's 15 seconds. I preferably, I actually prefer doing this on the web app because I prefer typing because I'm just quicker at that. Maybe you guys might prefer to do it on the console. Now, I'm going to check Gwendozy because for one, I know he sells. And we're going to check Van Aanholt and we're going to check, let's check, there we go, the core rate. So let's check Gwen Doozy. Pretty simple, guys. And you do this exactly the same for Hunter. Gwen Doozy. All we're going to do is check his cheapest buy it now in that chemistry style. Pretty simple stuff. 4.9K. Now, I know I've sold this guy for 4.9K before. And guys, big... Because of the injection of coins this year, maybe, you know, people ain't going to be looking at Gwen Doozy. It might take a couple of listings. But trust me, he will sell. Now... What we're going to do is we're going to try and win him, right? We're going to try and win him. So you want to make a decent amount of coins. You want to make a decent return on your investment. So I'm going to put 2.8K because if it comes in, my max bid is going to be 3K in my head. If it comes in, it's 1.5K. Now let's look at Van Arnholt. Now, guys, I'm talking quite quickly. I know that. I get a lot of comments last year. Glanda, you talk so quickly. You need to relax a little bit. I know that, guys. It's just the way I am in real life. It's very hard, you know, to not talk quickly. I get it told by my mates. It is what it is. Right. 6.2K. One at 4.9. One at 5.3. So we could probably say that around about 4.5 would be a decent undercut. And he would probably sell. Now, let's go to transfer targets. We'll see if we can win him. Now, Gwendozy, he's getting, he's getting a little bit of an open, uh, you know, a little bit of a, you know, a bidding war. It happens. during. It happens. Guys, when it comes to this method, you just got to accept. Sometimes you're going to lose that. So I'm going to bid 3.2 just for the purpose of this video. I might not win him. 4k it's not a very good deal you could still flip him but it's like 300 coins now let's look at the core because that has got some minutes behind him now it's got a minute left the core we're going to see how much we could possibly get him for so the core pretty simple guys you, you you know you literally just search the player up boom see how much he goes for 6.2k there's none on the market 7,000 coins, 6.7 in a CDM. That's been converted because I'm pretty sure he starts as a centre mid. Maybe I'm wrong. But yeah, about 6K. Can we pick this card up for any less? Now, once you've done that, let's have a look at Hunters, okay? Now, guys, I, I found... Oh, I, I hate this. I get stuck with these men menus all the time. I have found that um, I you know I get Shadows a lot more than Hunters. But... Pretty much the same process applies. You start off with 3K. That's what I like to do. Guys, if you've got more coins, maybe adjust your pricing range. So look, there's one Aspas, but then you've got to wait four minutes. No, you don't really want to do that. So let's just increase it by a 1,000 until we can bring those minutes down. Looks, do you know what I mean? It's now bumped up to 13 minutes. So you've just got to keep doing it. 45 seconds and have a look. 
Again, 20 minutes. Looks like there's not a lot of cards on Hunter. So what you do is you'll go back to Shadow. Now, can we win one just for the purpose of the end of the video? We want a Gwen Doozy for 3.2k. There's an Argo Aspas. I'm not going to bid on him because he goes, you know, I don't... I don't know if I'm going to win him or not. It's an extra minute on the video. So what I'm going to do is just list this card up for about 4.7k. Love to see it. 4.7k. Boom. See if he sells. Guys, that is going to be the end of the video. If you enjoyed it, right, I'm going to, sh put, I'm going to put some proof in between the video, right? Make sure you hit the like button, right? Make sure you subscribe for more videos on this channel, okay? We are going to start streaming at the moment. Only Yedlin sells. Guys, you do have to remember, actually, like, you know, Wilson, who's maybe because the injection of coins, who's going to be looking at Wilson? Just give it a bit of time. I'm going to put these up for about 6.3K, six, about 6.3K, 6.5K, because that's how I'm, I know how much he roughly sells for. This card goes for around about 6.8, I want to say. So, again, pretty decent coins, especially if you've got low budget. Guys, you've got 5K, you've got 10K, 15K, 20K, 100K, 150K. Like, this is how I'm going to be personally trading with until I maybe got that amount of coins where I can start flipping special cards, icons. I'm just not at that point yet. I missed so much by deleting that FIFA 20 club because I wasn't able to sign in on the web app. When I'd done the early access, it said I couldn't access the web app because I'm an early access user. Is what it is. Unfortunately, I'm quite a lot behind. I only got about 400,000 coins. Liquid at the moment is what it is. Again, guys, if you don't like open bidding, Try this. If you don't like it, look at Flair FIFA. I'll probably link his, you know, his stuff in the description. You know, he does pretty much exactly similar thing, but he goes to the 59th minute, does all these filters. Boom. You'll have to see it. If, you, if you're very good mentally at remembering prices, knowing trends of prices, you will make a lot of coins that way as well. And as I say, guys, make sure you hit uh, like on the video. And I'll catch you next time.